Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Plants vs Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today, we are taking a look at the legendary Pretty Cap costume for the Nightcap. Of course, this was the final reward in the Food Fight event. I was able to earn it all the way up, and I did record myself actually unlocking it, so hopefully that is being shown right now. I, I hopefully <laughs> remember to edit that in. But we unlock, of course, the Pretty Cap, and forgetting everything in Food Fight, that also unlocks the Kitty Cat, so, or Kitty Cap. So we'll be showcasing the pretty cap in today's episode and the kitty cap in the next episode. Uh, but first off, the pretty cap. This kitty makes pretty sound gritty. <laughs> and it looks amazing, very pink, very fluffy. Um, and a little bow tie too. <laughs> very friendly looking all around. So I enjoyed it a lot. Um, with that being said, that's all of the different costume pieces equipped. It's pretty simple actually. Um, along with it, for whatever reason, I'm recording this like right at the end of Food Fight. I think there's only a couple hours left. Um, yeah, four hours and 45 minutes left. And along with it, if we go over here, for whatever reason, all the character challenges were reset. I don't mind. So I might just go ahead and lock all of these right now. Um, because if we can earn up any extra uh, free prize bulbs before the end of the thing, that's awesome. We could dedicate those to next season's rewards for Feast of Us. So you know what? If we get some extra nightcaps done, stuff done in today's episode, the better. So let's go ahead and get started checking out the pretty cap. Or kitty, no, no, this one's a pretty one. Yeah, okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, so getting started with stuff with Nightcap here. While we're waiting for things to load up, I'll go ahead and see, oh, wrong thing. Uh, see what we wanna do here. When it comes to just easy things to get done, there's Fung Fu hits, Vanquish after Shadow Sneak, Earn Experience will be easy and I'll just have to just go along. Um, deal damage within Casting Shadows is probably the easiest one and then also landing Fung Fu hits, which of course is our triangle ability. This'll be a lot of fun. I already have four prize bulbs. I got a couple of them playing Super Brains around before this as I was waiting for it. It was just about to end, so I was like, okay, let me just play a Super Brains a little bit. But yeah, I'm already loving this costume. It's super duper adorable. I mean, it's not really too far off from Nightcap's typical colors, so I don't think this is gonna make her stand out too much more. But oh, I'm just, I'm so happy. And of course, didn't we get a new taunt along the way? Like well, Crouching Cap, that was a new taunt for Nightcap through food fight, it's pretty cool. All right, let's capture this payload. Oh, I thought I could jump on top of that. Save a bomb of granite, stop a zombie rocket, wear yogurt socks, don't do that last one. Okay, so I'm gonna run over this way just like this and deal damage while we're in the shadow ball and that's already working. Oh, hi, oh, hi. <laughs> All right, that was easy. That was totally accidental, but it worked out great. Oh, hello, sir, I need you to get fun food. It didn't work out, okay, hold on. Gotta be careful. I am doing some damage. Did I take out the bot there? Yes, I did, okay. Oh, no, you don't. Running, running away, running away. Okay, some flowers heal here to heal me up though, which would be great. Let's throw this down. Now, I can't see you, but you can't see me, so we're sort of tied. Boom, got the engineer a second time. Lucky me. Okay, that's working out pretty well. I'm gonna run over this way real quick. See if I can't sneak up on this guy. No, shadow, shadow, shadow and then go for it. He's gonna try to run, but I'm gonna try to chase after him and fail miserably. Oh my gosh, I'm pretty bad at that right now. Okay, get this down there. Almost got the storm on me, but didn't. Oh, ho, 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 the damage is racking up already. That's great. Uh, who's over here? Oh, it's, just, it's an electric slide and a zombie bot. Oh my, oh my, invisible run. Oh, I got stuck in the gravity grenade, oh no! <laughs> Not much I can do about that. But already a great run so far. Five vanquishes in on this first point. We almost got the first point, I believe. We're making it, we're making it. But I just have to say how happy and relieved I am I was able to get to the end of the food fight board. Of course, I wasn't so successful with Lawn of Doom. The only thing I missed out on was the, um, well, I think there were two things I missed out on, the legendary hat and maybe like a uh, victory slab. But that just bummed me out so much because it also mean I didn't get the final uh, Super Brains costume, the green Insecto Brains or whatever. Um, I was so bummed by that. That was me being silly, by the way. Um, but now I don't have to worry about that for this one. Hopefully in the future we won't because the prize bulb requirement is a lot less. As of today's episode, we're already getting a head start for Feast of Us, which is the next event. I want to hear your thoughts on Feast of Us. By the time this video goes out, Feast of Us has already started, but I'm recording it before Feast of Us starts. A lot of people don't seem to realize I record videos ahead of time sometimes, especially busy holiday times. Zebras have family to visit too, you know. <laughs> okay, um, what's going on over this way? 
I do see these guys. So I think the best thing I could do here is first vanquish this imp who is attempting to vanquish me. And then do damage while we're still figuring all that out. Oh, he got me. I didn't see that Captain Deadbeard. I should have, but I didn't. Oh, somebody got him? No, no, he just did like a weird taunt. Weird. Okay, so. I'm just gonna keep consistent. We still have a little bit of this point to capture, honestly. And I only have a little bit of experience left, though, before we get to where we need to be with this next prize bulb. Hopefully between this episode and next episode, we get a lot of prize bulbs. That would be awesome. Ow, okay, they're sort of kind of figuring me out there. Uh, oh, nice place to spawn in a little plant friend. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, you sort of do. Come on, I'm gonna get you. Or not, I can't, I don't think I've landed a single point of damage with Feng Fu. The weird thing here is that I, I I pressed L1 to throw down the shadow ball there like several times and just it didn't happen. I don't know what was going on. That was weird. We'll try again. Okay. But we have two minutes left to do it. I know that's enough time to make it happen. We just need to work together. I don't know where this imp is. Maybe I could do that. And just poke my head out a little bit. At least it's something. Destroy the mech. Ah, uh, it's not gonna work this way. We need to go over here, spawn something in, because they're just firing everything they have into there, which is like, that makes sense. Okay, Feng Fu, Feng Fu, Feng Fu. Ah, uh, come on, why do they always run away <laughs> every single time? Oh my gosh. It just, there's a bit of a lead in with it where Nightcap sort of, like goes, ha, right before she does it. And everybody is just sort of conditioned when they hear that move to run. So I just, I can't, I stink too much. I need to sneak up on them more. A minute 25, we were doing so well, but then they decided to do even better than we are. Okay, throw this down, start beating you up because you don't even see me. Oh my gosh, couldn't quite get you. That's all right, just keep attacking these guys. Where's the imp? The imp is here. Come on, we gotta get the imp. I can't get the imp because he's too tiny. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm running over here. Going to work on the zombie bot a little bit or have to reload. Come on, just a little bit more. Ah, oh, they figured me out. Boom, throw this down. Got it. Come on. This is our chance. Ah, uh, get on the point, get on the point, get on the point. I'm technically capturing it. Uh, technically. Okay, ah, oh, that just, as one nightcap, there's only so much I can do against like two to three engineers just throwing out their big bolt blasters. Oh my gosh. But we'll try again. 26 seconds on the clock and they're vanquishes, vanquishing us at our spawn, great. Oh, that's just too much. That's not really fair, <laughs> but so it is. Come on, no! I can't believe that stun followed me all the way here. Like that was ridiculous. Oh well. So, a little bit of a rough going for our first round. I mean, we got a lot of vanquishes, despite the fact that the game was being a little crazy here. I feel like we did pretty well, especially towards the beginning. Um, next round will be an even better, I hope. And we'll continue earning experiences nightcap, so that'll give, get us a couple of prize bulbs, but hey, they had three engineers. Okay, 10 seconds until this new round begins. We already got halfway there with our damage in our shadow. So we will try this again. And just, I'm just gonna throw it down and start attacking. As many people as I can, just stack up the damage. And of course, they're eventually gonna figure me out. But in the meantime, I got a vanquish, which is pretty cool. Okay, uh, watch it. And like I said, they're sort of moving over. But this is where I feng fu. Nice, okay, I got two. That's gonna be a prize bulbal meter reward, so we finally filled that up, and then we'll start working on another one now. <laughs> there was another uh, kitty cap over there. But since I haven't asked you guys yet, what are your thoughts on the kitty cap costume? Have you been able to earn it up yourself? And yeah, do you think it's worth all the effort? I definitely think it is. I mean, just the act of being able to say food fight is complete is worth all of the effort for me. That just makes me feel good that we're able to showcase all the content for you guys, especially for those of you who may have not had the chance to get it all. I wanna be able to at least show it to you guys so you guys can see what it's like. Um, Cause I know that's important to some of you and I wanna be able to be there. But uh, yeah, looks like they are pushing the payload, but it's gonna take them some time. So we just gotta get out there. Um, okay. I don't like dealing with parrots. Is there like three of them flying? There's three parrots flying around. I'm the destroyer of parrots. Oh my. 
Does this guy see me? Uh, not really, great. Come on, almost got him, got him, nice. Uh, we're going to run over this way, and I am going to Feng Fu this engineer. Got him, okay, so I'm starting to do Feng Fu damage, which is great. Oh boy. We're on the defensive team, which I feel like helps a lot more with catching out the zombies in a uh, precarious position. Um, okay, don't do not do anything rash now. Okay, I didn't land as much damage there as I wanted to. Oh, you don't know where I am. That means you're in big trouble. Oh no, you figured it out. Ah, I fell! <laughs> not what I wanted, where am I? I don't think he's figured out that I'm coming back. Okay, oh, Feng Fu, Feng Fu, Feng Fu. Oh, there's one. Can I get two? I got two, that was very, very nice. Ah, the game is, oh my gosh, the game is chugging along here. That is not good. Uh, let's throw down the shadow. There's nobody to attack. So this is bad timing. Oh well. Now I've only gotten 100 damage with that so far, or within it. Because I think we do 12 damage per primary weapon hit. And obviously the idea is that you would use Feng Fu while somebody's stuck in the shadows, but doesn't always work out that way. Okay. So let's run out to say here. Where is the zombie team? There is this guy up here, but my aim is apparently too bad for you. That, I did not land any, no, that's a lie. It says 654, did, I must have had less than that then. Cause I definitely landed some damage. Okay, this guy doesn't see me. Oh, come on, seriously? Not good. Let's go invisible again, and then get over here, throw down the shadow. I didn't even get to. Of course, the engineers just lobbing their stuff around. Come on. <laughs> so, things aren't going perfect, but they're not going that bad either if I take a look at the challenge progress right now. Um, I haven't gotten a full challenge completed, but we're almost there for the experience. We're almost there for that. Um, Land Feng Fu Hits is almost halfway there. It, I feel like Nightcap definitely had one of the more difficult set of uh, challenges to do this 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 event for Food Fight, but I think that's fine. Just means we gotta put more work into it. Uh, I mean, it's all bonus anyways. I've already gotten these done. For whatever reason, they just reset, <laughs> uh, which I really don't mind, because like I said, it's just bonus bulbs that we can use to prepare for the next event. Already we'll have five of them to spend. That'll be awesome and I'll try to do that as much as I possibly can. Okay, whoa, got an assist. I'm going to throw down the shadow. That is absolutely not where I wanted it, so I guess I might as well not even go down there. Okay, get him. No, he's gone. He is out of here. Yikes. I will revive my fellow. Ah, oh, no I won't. That was a dingus move of me. Not expecting he would turn around. Great. Oh, he's at like one hit too. I could have just gotten an easy vanquisher. Somebody will get him, right? Maybe, maybe not. Well, they're having a hard time getting the payload any farther, and they only have 30 seconds left to do it, so chances are looking good for us. We'll just have to keep trying, though. 20 seconds remaining. I'm trying to get out there. It's a little bit of a walk. Gotta do a tad bit of exercise. As they get it around this corner, though, we'll be in a pretty prime position to uh, stop them if they try to push. Okay. So I see this guy. Land some hits on him. That worked out pretty well. Not quite vanquishing him. Whoa, okay, I thought I got vanquished. I was like, what was that? The round ended, plants won. So it really was flip flop. The last the last time we lost in the first round, we got pretty destroyed. This time we win on the first round and we do some decent job destroying them. Not me specifically, but the plant team in general. So there we go. Uh, with that being said, we will uh, continue next round and see how it goes. Okay, so we're back on the defense. We'll see how that works for us. I don't really mind if this round goes a little longer. Stop them from capturing signal booster landing spots. Say no to zombie TV. All right. Uh, so the first thing I'll do is throw down the shadow and start attacking some people if I can. My aim is not always the best, but I try. Oh, what if I'm in somebody else's casting shadow? Does that count? That counts? Oh my gosh, that's great. Teamwork, I missed you really. Okay, great. I did get the vanquish though, so that's good. He's trying to find me. Ow, somebody else ended up finding me. Run, run, run. I need to get to somebody who can heal me. Or at least somewhere I'm safe enough that I don't have to worry about. Ow, what? What hit me, what hit me? Really, the thumb jump from the other side of the hedge? Oh, that stinks. 
I was in like prime position to do some damage to those super brains and earn up a good chunk of damage. I just need less than 200. That's all I need. 800 or 286. Or 180. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, it's early in the morning. I woke up right away so we could play some plants versus zombies. I wasn't ready for math. Okay, um, oh, I see this guy. Too late, too late. Here, let's, uh. Oh, that's not gonna get anybody. Ah, uh, I'm so bad with that, so bad. Oh, well. Looks like the good team is on the zombie side right now. It really does seem like there's like a very prominent team, and usually the game tries to flip you if you're on plants one round, it try to set you up as zombies the next. Obviously when that happens, I try to switch teams so that I can play the appropriate class for today's episode. So I'm sort of jumping between those two teams. Uh, Glittering Gizmos, a booster landed for the next the next one's head for Uno Taco. Well, we gotta defend those tacos. But Dave's favorite. Hmm. Can I make this jump? No, I can't. Oh well. Okay, super brains over this way. Is he gonna try to get me? Uh, I am the worst with timing now, like the worst ever. I feel like it had such a different feel to it before it was changed, of course. And I just, I haven't recovered since is the problem. Because the timing of it is, is very specific. You really need to know what you're doing with it. Anyways, we need to defend that point. If they're on it, we need to stop them from being on it. Okay, ready? Get you in here. You're going to punch me out in three punches. That was, that was it. I had full health and then I didn't. Darn. I just, I can't even get to the point right now. This is baloney. <laughs> okay. Well, they stopped reviving me because a mech was attacking them. I can understand that. Uh, come on, less than 100 points now. We can do it. It just, the game's not being very happy about it. Okay, get this here. Oh, almost got gotcha. you. Okay, somebody got gotcha. you, very nice. Now, I'm going to try to avoid them for a second and then turn back around, start doing our super spin, and you just jump in the air and then the camera goes sideways and I don't even know what happened. Okay, but we did get somebody. We literally need two more damage in shadow mode. There isn't anybody here, okay. <laughs> Great. I don't know if I should be, oh yeah, then you show up. Then you show up. Oh no. Oh no, run. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Cactus, the moment you're available. Okay, run, nope, nope, not happening. <laughs> we just got stuck on our head there. All right, well, that's fine. Let's wait for us to spawn back in. Now we can defend from the proper spot. I feel like this one is a pretty good one for the plants to be able to sit in a safe position while firing at the enemy. Typically, more than the other one. The other one, the zombies can sort of cut off the path the plants have to take to the point from their spawn. Not so much with this one. It's just two zombie, like two teams, plants and zombies on one side and then the other. Okay, I just need like literally one more hit and there we go. Okay, so two, two prize bulbs for that. Uh, we have plenty more experience to get. Okay, start spinning on you. Gotcha, excellent. And then you over there, not a big fan of what you're trying to do to me, which is to say you're trying to vanquish me. Okay, so where are you off to? You're off to Vanquish Town. That's where you're off to. No, wait, come back. Where's it going? Come on. Oh, that is so lame. <laughs> come on. Ah. Oh, well. They got me. Fair and square. So what challenge do we want to set next? Um, Not that. Wrong thing. Um... We have a couple of options. Support heroes is gonna happen how it happens. Land Fung Fu hits is probably our best bet. And we'll also get two, two uh, prize bowls for just getting another thousand experience. So we'll get there, we'll definitely get there. Hopefully we can reach level 10 today. Don't know what the chances are of that, but I will certainly try. Okay, they're getting this point quick. Oh no, I see all that stuff moving in. I don't wanna deal with, is there two clouds here? Jeez, the zombie team has been good today. Um. What even got me there? I don't know, they're just firing everything they have. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, this does make me very excited to see like what's gonna happen for Feast of Us. What, what are we gonna end up seeing for that um, in terms of the prize map? What kind of cool things? I know they have teased some of it. I've honestly not had much time to watch the live from Popcop live streams where they usually showcase like, hey, this is what's coming up in the new one. 
I don't know if they've revealed what Feast of Us has as its final reward, but once again, as of recording this, it'll all be clear by the time this video gets released. Um, but I'm really excited to see it, whatever it is. So there are tons and tons of zombies moving in. I feel like this is a perfect opportunity for the game to sort of get laggy, great. Okay, can I get you or no? Okay, ready for it? No, I'm not ready for it, oh my gosh, come on. I wish that was ever so slightly quicker, the rev up like to the Feng Fu. Because she takes us a full second just to sort of start spinning, and it's just so easy to get vanquished in that time. I don't know how other Nightcap players do it. I'm not very good with it. But at this point, I will really just probably want to rush in and try to hit Feng Fu as often, but there's no zombies here. Why am I trying to land Feng Fu on nobody that can be Feng Fu'd? Who is over here? Then you show up. You guys are experts at timing things perfectly. Okay, run. I'm at two health. I just need to leave. I need to leave. I need to skedaddle. Sunflower, sunflower. Heal me. Oh no. Uh. Thanks. No, not rip. I said thanks. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, what, what is that supposed to mean? Oh boy. Um, okay, time to get a little bit closer. I'm going to try the thing again. Oh, okay, that wasn't too bad. That was not too bad at all, I didn't take any damage. Okay, get you, you know, you're gonna get put in an orb as well. How do you like that? Oh, nice, okay. So at least I collaborated a little bit. Or did he get out? I don't know where he went. No, no, he got vanquished. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh double no. That is not good. Come on, get him as much as we can. This imp with the mech. And he got vanquished, excellent. Spawn something in here. Electric reed sounds good to me. Oh, I'm gonna get you. I am gonna get you. You don't even know, or do you? Ah, it just, it takes so much time that they're able to realize and just run. Where do you think you're going? Oh yeah, now you try to do this. Okay, well you'll get away for now. We'll just have to find somebody else. Uh Oh, you don't see me, but I don't have my thing right now. I don't even have it. I don't have the Feng Fu. Okay, throw you in the ball. Uh, you are not in the ball. Come on. I just has to get at least one of them. Excellent, I got up to 150 now, because it's landing Feng Fu hits, so it's not about the damage done, it's about how many times the damage sort of gets ticked for getting done. Watch out, Nightcap, watch out. Oh, almost got me revived. I appreciate the attempt. Okay. Well, there's 77% of the way there. We need to defend a little bit more, I guess. I mean, I was trying to defend point B. They apparently have point A. Okay, no. Uh-uh. Gotcha. That'll be one extra vanquish uh, for my one challenge, so that's good. Oh yeah, you better run. Gonna put you in the, this fear soon enough of doom, or not. I can't even see if I if he was or not. There you go, character challenge completed. That was probably the experience one. Um, Yep, because vanquish out of shadow sneak, I have made some progress on, but very little. Uh, What was that? Oh, that was a Snapdragon. I thought that was like a Super Brains jumping over me. Okay, so you're reviving him, good job. Oh, I see the simp. Well, does the imp see me? No, he does not. That didn't land anything. What are you talking about? Whenever I get stuck in that, I can't move much at all. Ah, baloney. Okay, this guy's trying to be a big problem. And he's basically succeeding. Got him. We have a times five vanquish streak right now. I want to keep that. I'll always keep it going for as long as I can because they are uh, winning at the moment. They're winning very quickly. Run. Ah, could not run in time. My health just melts because of that, which makes sense. It's supposed to be a damaging move. Okay. So how are we doing in terms of prize bulb? A thousand away to the next one, but that's gonna be it. That's fine. We'll go for one more round in today's episode, see how it goes, and maybe be able to reach level 10. I don't know. Okay, so it looks like we're all staying together. Awesome stuff, let's get to it. Capture the payload, we fell to this point last time, I will not allow that to happen this time. We need to just try, we need to just try, go for you. 
and you are getting vanquished real quick. Excellent, because it's not just me, it's a team of expert nightcaps and me. <laughs> I'm not a part of the expert part, but uh, I am a nightcap. Ow, ow, ow. Let's get out of here. Let's try from the side. I feel like that'll be a bit smarter. At least for a little bit. Let's see how long I can get away with it. Okay, that is a scientist. Oh, oh, let's get this heal. Thank you, thank you. You're the best. Okay, scientist over this way. Oh, now you're in trouble, you're trapped. You are trapped, and we got the vanquished. Scientist was over somewhere, didn't know where, where he went. It looks like he got vanquished. Okay, excellent. Uh, beat this guy up a little bit. Citron up there, going crazy. Stay together, we got this, we got this. Start getting you a little bit. Oh, he's uh, confused by the uh, the hypno shroom. Okay, somebody got him, I got an assist, which doesn't really help me much with my challenges. I do need the vanquished 25 scientists in total. I have five more to go with that. Oh, hello. Let's throw him in that. I don't know if he's in it, actually. I guess he's not. Um, <laughs> it's over before it really started for him. Um, I'm gonna go invisible, because he doesn't quite see me just yet. Do a lot of damage to him, and that's gonna be two prize bulbs because we completed it. Excellent. Um, and a prize bulb meter. Very, very cool. This is great. Let's revive you up. Oh, too late. Um, where was that coming in from? I do not know, but they got a couple of vanquishes on the sunflowers of all people. Bad, bad, bad. I, I wanted to throw that up there, but it just fell straight to the floor. That was bizarre. Um, okay, so they're just hitting me back as hard as I'm hitting them, so that's not good. So, oh, I'm being revived. Thank you, sunflowers. You're always the best. And we are going to just try to contribute as much as we can, as soon as we can. How are our vanquishes doing? We're already up to five. So this is like the same round as before. We got up to five vanquishes really quickly, but then this one's like, we actually made it past our first point as well. So it's like an alternate reality. Ow, who is hitting me right now? I don't know. Very confused about that. Okay, there is somebody way down this way. Trying to do what I can about them. Hmm, so at this point, I guess my main goal is to, if I've land Fung Fu hits, like it, that one's done, so let's go over here. We can either vanquish after Shadow Sneak or vanquish support heroes. I'm trying to vanquish support heroes anyways, so I guess I just need to go in the Shadow Sneak and then hop out of it, get a vanquish. Once again, already trying in that. So these next two challenges, if I don't really get them done, it's not the end of the world. This is all for a bonus anyways, so very happy about that. Okay, come on. You get back here. Sooner or later, you will no longer be a goat. Instead, you will be not vanquished because my aim's bad. Where'd you go? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, he is very low on health. I don't know if he will be once I get over there, but I am willing to try. Come on, got it, that's two out of 25, very nice. Okay, go back in the shadow sneak. He's gonna run away. Oh, he knew I'm here though, he knew it. Ah, uh, I don't think this is gonna be enough. Yeah, it will be enough, but it wasn't actually out of shadow sneak. There's only a limited amount of time. Definitely something easier to do in story mode, but I'm not too worried about that. Throw that, really? I wanted to throw it over there. Vanquish him, he's a support hero. Did that count as a vanquish? I think it did. Um, the engineer was a support hero there. Okay, this all-star doesn't seem to notice me, which is excellent for me. Oh, and he's gone. Ever oh well, that's not working. So we're doing a really good job keeping him back. Like we're not even pushing the payload right now. We gotta go back. Ah, uh, oof, not good. <laughs> Couldn't even see what's happening. I was trying to get behind the uh, the Citron shield. I guess a parrot got me. While well, I'm being revived while I'm on it. <laughs> that won't work so well. Wow, way back here, yikes. That's fine, we can make this work. Just gotta run over there real quick. But yeah, very happy that the challenge is open back up right towards the end because we were able to get up to 12 prize bulbs. I was not expecting that many. That's really cool. Okay, I feel like the game lags out whenever I'm trying to aim consistently. Like, is that just a thing that I'm experiencing? Like, you guys can see the video too. I, just, I feel like on average, like maybe I only realize it because I'm trying to focus, but I swear that when I'm really trying to make those aimed up shots, the game just sort of freezes up a little bit and gets confused, which is not good. But maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm inserting something there that wasn't originally there. Who knows? Uh, but for right now, can I get up here? Thank you, okay. 
Where are those zombies at? Because they are going down. Yeah, I'm gonna make him angry, and then I'm just going to run away. Yeah, he's just trying to punch, trying to find me. Okay, where is he? Come on, get him, get him, get him, got him! And that was three out of 25, yay! Only 22 more to go! Oh well. I think definitely it'll be more worth it to focus on the support characters and the scientists, which I, you know I'm doing, but I can only control that so much. Uh, yeah, we're almost pushing this payload. I think at this point it might be more worth it just to focus in on playing the game, trying to be as efficient as possible if the challenges get done along the way. Awesome. Oh, I see you up there. I didn't know you could get up there. I've tried and I have failed. So I don't know how you did it, but you did. I definitely need to get you. You have a big target on your back being up there. Okay, let's try again. Respawn. I am excited to see what next uh, events challenge characters are gonna be. Because last time in Lawn of Doom, what was it? It was Pea Shooter, Citron, um, Scientist, and 80s Action Hero. Um, this time, of course, it's Super Brains, Nightcap, Captain Deadbeard, and one plant, what plant was it? Uh, was it Chopper? We'll find out in a moment. Um, no, it was Sunflower, that's what it was, Sunflower. Uh, so, I'm curious, I'm thinking it's gonna be, my guess is it will be Chomper and Rose, or maybe Chomper Cactus. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. I think there's gonna be one new class. Which new class out of the game have we not seen? Maybe Acorn and Cactus, I feel like that'd be a fun combo. And for the zombie side, um, Engineer and Electric Slide, I think would be good. Anyways, you over here, you don't quite see me. I'm trying to beat you up because of that. Oh, he's running, don't you dare. Ah, okay, everybody's going for me, but I was able to get out of there. And the, wait, the round's over? Oh no, <laughs> I was thoroughly way too distracted there. That's my bad, sorry team. Really, it seems like, I guess they really just put up the defense towards the end. Oh well, I feel like I I was totally responsible for that, but oh well. So there was our look at the pretty cap costume, of course, the pretty pink cat costume. Next episode, we're doing the same thing, but with the kitty cap costume. Really looking forward to that, but like I said, let me know your thoughts. I don't have any prize bulbs to spend, unfortunately, because we've spent them all, but we have 12 ready for the next event. That's gonna be a lot of fun, but for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment, pretty zebra, so if you've watched at the end of the URA, zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the zebra herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.